Sergeant William Stacy was a great friend, a loving son and brother, and a leader who lived and died by the Marine Corps motto, always faithful. Marines serving with 2nd Battalion, 4th Marine Regiment, gathered February 15th to honor their fallen squad leader and posthumously award him the Bronze Star Medal with Combat Distinguishing Device for Valor. The medal was presented to his parents. Any medal that it doesn't go to an individual, it goes to all the guys that that individual worked with and led and served with. Uh, that's absolutely the way we feel yeah. about it. This, this is for every guy that, that fought with Will and served with Will. Uh, his number one priority was to bring those guys home safely. On his final deployment to Helmand Province, Afghanistan, Stacy led his Marines through numerous combat engagements with the enemy. The award citation specifically details one incident where Stacy exemplified bravery. He personally moved 200 meters over exposed ground and under enemy fire so his squad could achieve fire superiority. We're getting shot at pretty good and bullets landed pretty close to me and I kind of froze. And I think, you know, a lot of us did at that point. And he was the guy that just kind of, you know, he, he kept calm like he always does and uh, he got up and he looked right at me and he goes, Otterson, and he goes, we're moving, let's go. And just this, that calm voice and his demeanor he had during that moment just, you know, got us all through it that day. Tragically, Stacy was killed during a routine foot patrol two months later. His fellow Marines from Weapons Company continued to share stories and lessons they learned from him. He was really outgoing. I mean, it didn't matter who you were, whether you're American or Afghan, like he liked to take care of people and talk to people. Reporting from Camp Pendleton, California, I'm Marine Sergeant Michael Zapuentes.